When would you say you first started feeling this way? Oh, geez. 50 years ago? More? This feeling that it's all your fault? Well, whose fault is it? I'm their home. Where else are they going to live? Mars? I mean, give me a break. They can't even agree that the sky is blue, and they're going to pull something like that together? Sure. Well, some say they're responsible for your condition, not you. Burning fossil fuels, greenhouse gases. Yeah, right. Look, I've been through how many ice ages? I've lost count. Do you know how hot it was when I was created? Like a thousand degrees. That may be true, but now you have eight billion people to keep alive. That's the thing. Now what do I do? Before, I could just push through a flood, a wildfire, a drought. It sounds like what you're saying is you need some help. Now? After four and a half billion years, all of a sudden I can't deal with it on my own? Do you know how that feels? Can you say it? What? Can you say, I need help? I know it's hard. It hurts. I know. How about we say it together? I... I... I need help. Good. So pretend you're speaking to them. What kind of help do you need? What do you want them to do? I want them to help me push through. I want them to keep it going. That's what God wants, isn't it? It's got to be what he wants. He didn't create all this just to see it end. No, no he didn't. Climate change. Even if you believe it's just a temporary cycle of nature, one thing is certain, it's threatening our way of life. But if we can help save God's creation by burning less fossil fuel and putting serious effort into developing more wind and solar energy, shouldn't we do it? Isn't that what he would want us to do?